Hi everybody, um, my name is Rick Noble. I'm with the Mason County Arts Council. I'm president of the Arts Council. Um, we're here at the uh, Town and Country Arts Show that the uh, Mason County Arts Council does uh, do once a year. Um, I'd like to take you around and show you some of the things that, for the entries that we have this year. Um, we have classes of uh, different, from adult all the way to uh, down to sixth and seventh uh, age groups. Um, there's several different paintings. There's oil painting, uh, sculpture, uh, jewelry art, uh, pottery, all sorts of arts of any kind people are welcome to bring. Um, this is open to everyone um, in Mason County and beyond. We have people that come from different counties um, also. Um, that enter every year. Um, this year we have a show that's a little bit um, less because of the, the time frame. The, normally our show is in April of uh, the year. This, this year it's in August. Um, we, we're down on our numbers. We have about 49 entries uh, this year. But we've had some wonderful work. Um, we have a lady here um, that does an acrylic, um, acrylic painting. Uh, she does a lot of landscaping. Um, her name's Kathy Johnson. She lives in Bath, Illinois. She's also on the on the city council or the, the arts council. Um, a very talented lady. Um, we have another member that is also on our board that is he's done fused glass. Um, there's a lot of different medias that people work in. Uh, we have pen and ink drawings from people uh, from around. This lady's from Ipava. Julie Larzak is a photographer from our area. She has entered. Um, this year she received Blue Ribbon uh, for her butterfly um, rendition, which is very interesting. Uh, we have over on this side, for the adult division actually, uh, Kathy Johnson with her uh, landscapes, waterscapes. Uh, she received a, a Blue Ribbon and uh, Honorable Mention, or not Honorable Mention, but a uh, Best of Show. Uh, we do two of those, one for the adult division and one for uh, the children of a whole, student division. Um, we have photography of different kinds here. Um, we have black and white photographs from an area uh, art teacher. She's brought things in. Um, she received some uh, recognition for her picture of uh, old cemetery gate and uh, the post it looks like. Um, the name of this one is Somewhere in Time 2, which she did a series of, of photos on that. Also, we have uh, students in the ages of 16 to 18 here. Um, this young lady is Vanessa Coleman from Havana. She received the best of show and blue ribbon for her watercolor of still life here. And she's a very, very talented young lady. There's another one here of um, a block print that she did, which is very good. She's a very talented young lady. We have several people uh, that do photographs. This is another young lady that uh, entered for her photography. She's got a blue ribbon on her uh, color wheel is what she calls it, part one, and it's her yellow. It looks like a, a black-eyed Susan flower, I think is what it is. Uh, over here we have the younger younger kids, ages eight to 10. Um, it's kind of a neat one here, this little panda, panda painting of a watercolor that um, is by um, McKenna Bleen. And she, uh, she's very, uh, she, in the age group of eight to 10, I'm not sure exactly what age McKenna is, but that's pretty good for a little kid that that's start now. Um, we had a blue ribbon by uh, her brother. Um, he's called this Baby Liger. Now I think that's probably a cross between a tiger and a lion, but I'm not sure, but that was what's on the papers. So that's what he entered. But he got a blue ribbon for that, which is great. Um, we have Isaac uh, Snyder from Havana. He's 8 to 10 um, with uh, the Eager family. Um, the kids are very talented. They, they really work in their wildlife and do the things that they like to do. So, and, and these kids are first, some of these kids are first time people. They, they've never done painting before. They've never done artwork before. And they've 
got interested in it, and they've done some pretty good work, I think. There's another lady, the young lady here, um, Sky Mids, 14 to 15 age, age range. Um, she received two blue, two blue ribbons, um, one for her fruit growing, which I believe is uh, pastels. And then she also has a photo uh, photograph here of a Rose of Sharon that she also received the blue ribbon on. Um, six to eight year olds we have here. Um, we have Ben Snyder was another one. Perchy the Toucan is what he named this one. This is kind of cool. He got a blue ribbon in his, his age group for, for his picture of that. He also did a little rattlesnake. Um, the kids are very, very good at what they're doing, and uh, I, I love that they're doing it. We, we try to keep this going. Um, we have this once a year. Uh, sometimes we have 80 to 100 people uh, enter things. Um, we have a lot of people come through the show every year. It's usually on a Saturday and a Sunday. Uh, they come in from 1 to 5 on, sat on the Saturdays that the show runs, and usually uh, one to four on the, on the Sunday of the show. Um, we usually have a date um, advertising the paper. We also send out flyers, letters, um, put posters uh, out, put it on the radio and in the newspaper for newspaper articles. So it, it is advertised for the people. Um, let's see what we have over here. We have and now on 62644.com. There we go. Okay. We have uh, age group 11 to 13, and uh, we have Andrew Sinnermaker, and this is the first time this boy has ever entered uh, any artwork at all, in any, any project and done something. And he ended up doing an edition of a Picasso type piece, which is, um, it's pastel, and he received a blue ribbon for it. Um, Joe Hohenschel. He also is a young artist in 11 to 13. He received the blue ribbon for his duck in gloomy reflection. This is an oil painting, which he did a very good job at. Um, the 8 to 10 group, we have a blue ribbon here, which is uh, a pastel painting or pastel drawing. Um, Sam Gleam, it's called Puffin, which you can see that that's what it is. And also, there's a young man here, um, Samuel Weaver, Tiger in the Water. This was his first oil painting. And he's done an excellent job with this. This, this is the first time he's ever worked with oil, or paint, painted at all. So he's done a very, very good job. Um, we have a lot of talent in this county, and I wish that more people would participate in this. Um, we'd love to have everybody know about it and, and participate in it. Um, everybody's welcome. Um, if you need any information, we, uh, you can contact us through the public library here in Havana and um, call there, ask questions, um, call, give us a call, and uh, we can send you out information or talk to you on the phone either way. So I'd like to thank you for, for being here today.